So I had absolutely no research experience when I came to UCLA. Um, I didn't have much research experience at all. I didn't have any. I didn't have any. <laughs> Most undergraduate students do not have any prior research experience before coming to UCLA. Today, your friends at the UCLA Library and the Undergraduate Research Centers are here to help you get started with research at UCLA. In this video, we'll introduce you to several UCLA students that are working on undergraduate research projects. As these students talk about their experiences, brainstorm your own ideas, and take notes, then we'll help you turn these notes into an initial plan to get your project started. Here at UCLA, all undergraduate students can get involved in research. Lower division, upper division, north campus, south campus, there are opportunities for everybody. Most often when people think of research, they imagine a scientist running a chemical reaction in a test tube. But in reality, research can be done on any topic in any discipline. I'm currently working on a project where we're observing um, communication between cells via extracellular vesicles. I spent eight weeks in Israel doing research with the Ethiopian Jewish community there. My research focuses on the 1930s deportations and repatriations of the Mexican population. My research is looking at black community college students and their experience with the financial aid process and how that might affect their community college experience. I'm working under a medical sociologist, so we're looking at social relationships and its effect on allostatic load. We have two undergraduate research centers on campus, one devoted to the humanities, arts, and social sciences, and the second one for the sciences, engineering, and math. There are many different ways to get involved with research, including programs depending on your specific interests. Such opportunities include departmental, upper division, independent research courses, volunteer research, and research through internships and community service. But why should you do research? Research can be a huge part of your undergraduate experience with many benefits and rewards. Um, well, one of the reasons I chose to do it was I wasn't sure if anthropology in like a graduate sense or getting into the field like in academia was right for me. I've been surrounded by such incredibly intelligent people all the time <laughs> and they're all so welcoming and willing to work with you. Definitely expanded my worldview and perspective. Conducting research is a great way to gain valuable skills and experiences, engage with faculty members, resume build, expand your interests, and help you with your career or graduate school path. Through participating in research, students can also get research scholarships, present at conferences, and even get published in journals. When can you get started? Right away. For SRPs or research courses, you'll want to sign up during your regular class enrollment, but programs like Mellon and Bicep have application deadlines. And don't worry. If the process of getting involved in research seems daunting, there are plenty of people and organizations at UCLA dedicated to helping you find your research path. You can stop by either Undergraduate Research Center or one of our many library locations to set up a consultation. Good luck with your research! I think my biggest piece of advice is to not be intimidated because there is help. There are plenty of programs and advisors um, that are willing to help. Feeling like I'm part of this community, not just like in the academia, but amongst my peers, where I feel like I'm an expert. If you're really, really passionate about a certain project, make it known. And I think, you know, if that means going to meet with a professor in person or sending them a really, really detailed answer about why you want to be involved in their project, just go for it because you really have nothing to lose.